Hey everybody, Paul here back with Flashback Friday. So I know I haven't had one of these in a little bit, um, sorry about that, it's, uh, it's hard to do some of these sometimes because it's, it's hard to explain. But anyway, we're going to be doing another part of Pokemon Snap. And there's probably going to be either one or two more parts, either this one or, uh, honestly, I think probably going to be one more part after this and then it's, I'm going to be able to finish the game completely. That's how short this game is. But yeah, um, anyway, let's go back to River now that we have the Pester Ball. Yes. Okay, so now that we have the Pester Ball, we're going to be able to get a lot more of the... Um, Pokemon. Get good pictures of them. So first off, if we keep doing that, the Poliwags will start jumping out of the water. And I think that's good. Okay. And another thing we can use the pester ball for um, is going to be right over here. If we throw one over at this stinky plant. Wait, no, never mind. That's for something else. Never mind. That's for a different item we get in a later thing. Wow. Um, not see that happening, but okay. That was a really good picture of Poliwag. Okay. So, also get a good picture of Metapod. Because he'll come down for us. Ran right into him. And we killed Psyduck. <laughs> we killed Psyduck! No! And if we use the Pester Ball over here, we can get another new character. Porygon! We can get another one right over here. But the one we really want is going to be right over here. And what he's going to do is open up a whole new section, which is awesome. So we're going to go down. Woohoo! So we took a lot of pictures. We'll pick whichever ones we want the most. Is there any... Ooh, that's a really good one of Poliwag. Um, that's a good one of Metapod. There, that's good for picture of Porygon. I want to use that one, sorry. Okay, let's go to Professor Oak to show him these three that we have. Let's see what he says. Poliwag. It's better size. Jumping. Technique is so much better. Yay, he likes that one more. Metapod. Size is so much better. Pose is so much better. And technique is so much better. <laughs> and then Porygon. Yay! Okay. So. Ooh, let's return to the lab. Welcome back. Welcome back! Paul, you found a split in the path. According to my research, that split should link to a new course. I've also made a link for my lab. You should go right away! Okay, let's see what the new area is. It's cave! Ooh, scary! Um, but before I go into cave, I want to go back to beach. Yes! Because there's a few characters that we can get now that we have the pester ball. It's actually fun to... Hit the Pidgeys with these pester balls. Okay.
die, Pikachu. <laughs> I don't know why I tell it to die, but I do. Oh, I do. Whoa, this looks like a Pokemon. What could that be? Well, we'll find that out later. Because that is something we're going to have to do later. So the first Pokemon we can get with the Pester Ball here is Snorlax. Because he actually comes up from being pestered. And then we can hit Meowth down. And he'll be mad at us and start Fury swiping at us. Or no. Just does some poses. And then if we throw some Pester Balls in here... Yes, we get Scyther. Okay. So there, already we have a new uh, character. Get some more Pikachu pictures. I don't think... No, I don't get anything from throwing pester balls into there. But I'm pretty sure we can get another Scyther? No, okay. Never mind. And then we already have a chancy, a good chancy picture. But now we can also get Genghis Khan. Great picture of Kangaskhan yelling at us. Oh, and there was a Lapras in the background. Save him! Yay! We saved him! Yeah, it's just some more magic caps. But we got some uh, good pictures. I mean,. We got Snorlax, and we got uh, a better picture of Kangaskhan. We got Scyther. It's pretty great. Um, I like this one the best. <laughs> I, I want to do that one, because that one just looks funny. Um, I guess that's the best one of Scyther I have. Uh, let's see how this one does for the Pikachu. Oh, that's... oh, that one's cool. Actually, no. I'm gonna choose that one. That one looks the best. Okay. So, to Professor Oak with those, and let's see how he rates us for those. So, Snorlax. Size is good. Pose. Scratching its tummy. And we got double for being in the center of the frame. Okay, so size is better. Pose is better. And technique was better. <laughs> Scyther. You were close. Oh really? Okay, that's fine. Wow, is this one that much better? Well done. Oh, wow! I got a lot of points for that one. And... This one's so much better. Well done. Okay. So we got two extra kinds. Um... Welcome back. Yeah, let's go into cave now. See what we can find in there. We'll actually probably find a lot of stuff. Honestly, the cave is fun though. Get some Zubat pictures. That doesn't look like a normal Bulbasaur. Keep missing it though. Maybe we'll find a better, better ones over here.
Whoa, it's a ditto. Yay! And if we turn quick enough, we can get a picture of coughing. And if we throw this at a... Come on. Oh, nope. Here's a better picture of well, Jigglypuff and then coughing and then blow coughing up. Hmm, I thought something came out of there. I guess not. Oh, wait, no. It's, uh... The hit weeping bell into there. So and he's going to evolve into victory bell. Oh, we missed him. Ah, that's fine. Now, if we're able to hit the Zubat, come on, come on, no, oh, no, no, come on, come on, can we get him, can we get him, please, please, luckily we have infinite pester balls, but uh, it doesn't look like we can, that's okay, uh, but if you get him, it, you can uh, do that, get some good pictures of Jinx, going next. Okay, we're going up this way. Yes, and this is the best picture of Jigglypuff you can get of her singing to you. And I'm pretty sure if you... Yeah, she gets like really... And she gets, like, mad at you if you throw a pester ball. It's kind of funny, actually. Okay. Now we got some good ones from that, I'm pretty sure. Oh. Wow, we only did 31 pictures. That's, that's like a... Okay, I'm going to keep my picture of Zubat. Um... Do that picture of Ditto. Let's do this picture of coughing. We'll do this picture of Weeping Bell. This one of Victory Bell. That one of Jinx. And we'll do that one of Jigglypuff. And that should be good. Yes. So we got... Get there! And it's in the double... Uh, it's in the middle of the frame, coughing. Oh crap. Technique. Oh crap. Weeping Bell. Yes. Victory Bell, that better be a good one. Wonderful. Okay, Jinx. Oh wow, it's better than I thought it was gonna be. Wonderful. <laughs> wow. And then Jigglypuff. Oh. Wonderful. Yay! So we got we're at forty kinds of Pokemon now. Welcome back. You are doing a fine job, Paul. Choose go to course. Ooh, now we can go to the valley. Um, I'm going to do valley, and then uh, I'm probably going to stop it after that. Okay. So, let's take some pictures of Pokemon.
get a Squirtle picture. Ooh, ooh, Dratini, er, Dratini. Okay. Let's get a... Okay, Minky's not gonna come down. But if we do that, we can get Geodude and Sandshrew. of him. Okay. Can we hit even all the way up there? No, I didn't think so. Okay. Here's a better picture for Mankey. No, I missed it! Dang it! This stupid thing. I'm pretty sure if I... Well, or maybe it's a apple? Maybe it's not even at this one. I I don't know. That's going to hit the Mankey over the top. Which I'm pretty sure if I hit him a certain way. And this one. Yeah, he's going to open up another new area. He's going to fall back, hit the switch, and open up a whole other area. Oh, this place looks cool. Oh. Oh, hi, Paul. What a surprise to see you here. I suppose you'd like to know why I'm here. Ah, well, I received some interesting information at the Pokemon Lab. It seems that there are six Pokemon signs hidden on this island. They have something to do with important Pokemon that are here. The signs are scenery which seem to resemble Pokemon. One sign is a mountain that looks like Doug Trio. I came here to look for it. However, I can't go anywhere deeper into the island, so I can't find it. Have you seen a mountain that looks like Dugtrio? Oh, I have an idea. If you find this Pokemon sign, take a picture of it like you would a Pokemon. We might discover clues from the pictures in the places where you took them. Shall I repeat this information? Please Wait. no. Wait, I will add a page to po for Pokemon signs in the Pokemon report. See you later. So now we can start looking for Pokemon signs, which is really easy, if you know where they are, which I do. So let's choose some stuff. I like that picture of Dratini. Uh, no. I got some better ones, I think. That's the best one of Sandshrew. That's a good one of Geodude. I'll take that of Mankey, see if it gets me anything. Um, I'll take that of Staryu. We'll take that for Dragonite. And, okay, that's it. To the Professor.
Okay, let's see what's new this time. Squirtle. Size is okay. Pose is pretty good. Technique. It's double. Same Pokemon. Or 60. Yay! Okay, Dratini. Let's see the size. 390. Good. 800. Times 2. Geodude. 390. 1000. Times 2. Sandshrew, 560, 1000, times 2, <laughs> Mankey, 260, 800, oh wow, yay, I'm glad I chose that one, Staryu, size is 380, Bose 500, Technique times 2, that's all I need, Dragonite, 890, 800, times 2, so, wow, we have 47 kinds of Pokemon now. <laughs> Welcome back. Here's something to make your search for Pokemon signs easier. Would it be great if the Zero One moved faster? Well, now you can use this dash engine if you want to go faster. It's easy to use. Press R to make the Zero One move faster. Shall I repeat this information? No, thank you. First of all, see the Pokemon sign page. So... Now we have to search for the Pokemon signs. So there's one of a Krabby, there's one of a Pinsir, there's one of uh, Coughing, Doug Trio, of Mewtwo, and of Cubone. And I am pretty sure I know where all of those are. But I am not going to be doing that this episode. I am going to be doing that next episode. And next episode is definitely going to be the finale. And I'm not going to be 100%ing this because I don't want to. <laughs> I don't feel like doing all that stuff right now. So, yeah. Anyway, hope you guys had a fun time watching because I had a fun time playing. Please like, subscribe, comment, favorite this video. It really helps me out and I really appreciate it. Anyway, see you next time, guys. Bye.